Tracy Nelson here with E3 Realty. I'm also here with Nathan Nelson of New American Funding. And another myth in our buyer series is that you need a high credit score to buy a house. Come on guys, you don't need perfect credit to buy a home. Many of us know this. However, if you have a low credit score, you should expect to pay higher mortgage interest rate or additional fees. I highly recommend you connect with me earlier rather than later. We might also have to talk about different types of programs. The sooner we can talk about that or talk about raising your credit score, which we can help with that as well, the better we are. Okay, so it is usually quite a bit easier than you think and we don't want you doing this on your own trying to raise your credit, we can help with that. And a common myth is that you don't want to call a real estate agent until you're ready to buy. The truth is the earlier you bring in an agent to help, the better, and they will connect you with their preferred lender. An agent can help you set realistic parameters in your home search, identify the best time to start looking, and create a plan to help you reach your real estate goals. And they also connect you, as she said, with the preferred lender, and that's a big piece of this because they're going to help you plan out the next steps and how can you plan the sale and purchase of your next home if you haven't worked out the finances. My goal is for you to become a homeowner, even if you are years away. Another myth in the buyer series is that it is all about location. Yes, location is important, but you also need to think about how the home will function for you and your family. If you're on a limited budget, you may need to sacrifice your ideal location to get more space or a newer home that requires fewer updates and less maintenance. Another myth in our buyer series is that your only upfront cost is your down payment. See, that's where I come in. When you're buying a home, you're actually focused on your cash to close. Your cash to close is made up of your down payment plus your prepaids, so taxes and insurance, plus your closing costs. Okay, those three things make up your total cash to close. And if you're only budgeting for the down payments, you're not gonna have the funds available for your purchase. So you'll also need, aside from that, cash available on hand to pay for the inspection and appraisal. That's right, yes. Your lender, such as Nathan Nelson, can help you estimate the exact amount that you'll need. Feel free to contact us and we will help you. Thank you.